we both have rough edges. We both have rough edges. We call it teamwork. Guys, me and the Lord. We have a lot of fun together. I see them. I see you and Daddy. We promised the Lord that we would do everything we could do to achieve that goal. Hello, happy Sabbath everyone. Wow, I feel like it's been a while since I talked to the camera. But it is a, a wonderful Sunday. We had state conference down the street at Utah Convention Center earlier this morning. Right now, Daddy's on an appointment. Yeah. And we're just watching a bunch of Mormon messages. That's what we've been doing, right guys? We cleaned up. We tied it up and now we're resting, watching Mormon messages. And our Mormon message popped up in the playlist, so we are enjoying it. Such a great message. It's a great reminder for me to told those natural expressions of love. Express gratitude for what your spouse does for you. Express that love and gratitude. What we love each other. She loves this Mormon message, huh, honey? Have faith in those promises. And live to be worthy of them. Where are mommy and daddy? We're done. It's done. Next Mormon message. Okay, so when we were filming our Mormon message at the Provo um, movie studio, we got Peter and I got to see a behind a, behind the scenes sneak peek to this Mormon message right here. They actually let us watch a couple of minutes minutes of it before it was released a couple of months later. And I thought it was so cool. I felt very honored to be able to see this Mormon message before anyone else. <laughs> ah. So I'm still editing on this ugly laptop because I still don't have the editing programs for my desktop that my dad got me. The screen is still broken. Yes, the screen is still broken. And so, but we're still using it because it still works really nice. So the screen, I mean the LCD part looks really nice. But yes, I'm still using this and it's taking forever. So I'm trying to, okay, this is iMovie. I don't like iMovie, but I have to use it anyway because my Final Cut isn't working. I'm only uploading three clips into this program right now and it is taking an hour just to do it, just to do three clips. How annoying is that? Yeah, but I'm hustling through it because I'm dedicated. And I'm driven to complete this. I've been doing this for eight years. Look who made it home. This is what we need. And now we got dinner cooking. What is for dinner? Tell us. We got some ribs. Some sweet and sour ribs. Um, I use the NOH packets packets from my from my parents. And I just I rubbed it all over that. You should show them the package of um, seasoning that they got you. I did. Oh. Yeah, it's in there somewhere. I'm flooded. You farted? No, I'm flooded. You farted? No, I'm flooded. What, what do you say? Ooh, feet. <laughs> Ooh, stinky. Mm. Ooh, yucky. <laughs> Does anyone even actually buy and eat this? No. Daddy, daddy, daddy. So there's a picture of Pico when he was like three, eating this and sleeping. Here's a picture of him when he was little. Wasn't he just so cute? Look at him now. That was his thing though. Every time he would eat when he was younger, he would just fall asleep eating. Hurry up. up. And I found an evening. Tell help your sister. Go. Hurry up. 
<laughs> because scared. Always want to eat. When do you not want to eat? Don't. Are you gonna clean up that mess? Are you gonna clean up that mess? No. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> Marys, what are we doing right now? <laughs> okay, tell you. Can you lead us in a song, please? We are having fam home evening right now. For those, uh, for those we love, right? Do you want, do you want me to be happy? Do you want mommy to be happy? You want, you want each other to be happy, right? Right? And so we always want, we always want happy, happiness for those that that we love, and so we want uh, as little pain for them as possible, right? Do you want daddy to be happy? Mm -hmm. Do you like when daddy's in pain? Mm -hmm. Huh? And my tooth is sore. Mm -hmm. No, right? Okay. And then as we read uh, the accounts of happiness and of pain in the Book of Mormon, our hearts mm -hmm. are steer stirred as we think of our loved ones. Mm -hmm. Here is a true account of a time of happiness. Okay? Actually, I wanted to us to take a turns, okay, and share a, a time that you remember when you were the most happiest. Okay? <laughs> Um, so for me, uh, I have had a lot of moments when I've been the most happiest. But I think for me, it was when um, the first time I felt the most happiest is when, when I was born. Was when me and mommy got married. I knew it. I think that was the first time I was ever that uh, I was the happiest I've ever been was when me and mommy got married. And then, and then, <laughs> my birthday, <laughs> which was the day you were born. He was there when you was born. Yeah. Yay! And me too. And you yes, he was there when you were born. In your bed. Okay, go ahead, Pico. Uh, <laughs> first day of school. First day of school? Mm -hmm. Cool. That's really good. That's so cute. What about you, Tab? Yeah, when was the time that you were the most happiest? I don't know. Can you come back to me? Yeah, what about you? When was the time you were the most happiest? Right now. When you were born? You remember when you were born? Were you very happy to come to mommy and daddy? That's nice. <laughs> Okay, so my happiest, one of my happiest times in my life was actually when I was pregnant with Amara and when I gave birth to Amara. Oh, wow, not me. <laughs> wow. The birth. reason for that is because at that time in our lives, we were doing very well financially. Peter had his career going. I was almost done with school and we were we were headed on the right direction and it was that feeling of accomplishments and success and a peace of mind and and knowing that um, we're going we're we're living a good life and I and just the mirror brought me so much peace when I was pregnant with her 
And when I gave birth to her, it was seriously like one of the happiest moments of my life. So does she still bring you peace? <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, but I, Great I, angle. I'd like to... <laughs> I'd like to bear my testimony. Um, that I know that Heavenly Father wants us to be truly happy, and that um, that all we have to do is is make right choices, right? And we have to pray to Him and ask Him for His promised blessings. Okay, we have many blessings in store for us uh, to 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 bless our lives. Okay, and and I know that as we choose the right, we will be happy with our choices. Okay, and I say these things in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 Walk beside me. Help me find the way. Teach me all that I must do to live with Him someday. <laughs> her face <laughs> her face was like I'm gonna kill you yeah you hey hey <laughs> don't do that yeah you <laughs> oh what is this oh can I taste it this is ribs a sample is that for you Oh my gosh, that looks so good. Can I taste it? Oh, things up there, things up there. With that huge fork. Oh, things up there. Good. Bad. Oh my gosh. It's good, um. Oh my gosh. Sweet and sour spare ribs. Sour. Oh my gosh, this is like amazing. Sour. Isn't it? Oh. Watch it, turn it. Let's turn it like a commercial. Call us on the sweet. Juicy, succulent taste of of ribs. <laughs> ribs. <laughs> Eat my Sweet ribs. and sour ribs. Call us at three eight five two three six nine seven nine nine. Oh, don't tell them our number. Good with the <laughs> What's with your thuggish music there, Maris? Fast forward four more hours. And it is midnight. This is me closing the vlog for today. We are not, we haven't been very good at closing our vlogs lately. So New Year's resolution, we are gonna close our vlogs. Today was the Sabbath. It was great. It was wonderful. Peter made some delicious sweet and sour ribs with corn and brown rice. It was the bomb. But now it is time for us to go to sleep because we have to wake up extra early to go to the gym. Oh, it's so exciting. It's hard, but we go anyway because we have to. I wish I could show you, Peter, but Peter's not dressed for the camera. <laughs> okay, thanks for watching, guys. We love you. Bye. Have you ever heard the wolf cry to the blue corn Sing with all the voices of the mountain Can you paint with all the colors of the wind? Can you paint with all the colors of the wind?